The fully equipped resource center established through the Uwezo Fund has three facilities at Inkinya village who will train women on how to sew clothes with the first priority targeting reformed circumcisers with 55 women already identified. <laughs> School dropouts and teen mothers will also benefit from the project, dubbed Cut the Garment, Not the Girl. Upon completion of a three-month training, the women through home-based circles or chamas will use Weso Fund to buy machines and set up their businesses. Speaking during the launch, anti-FGM board members Agnes Lena said the fight against FGM will only be attainable if drastic collaborative measures are put in place. The whole project is about uh, resource mobilization and about entrepreneurship a different kind of business not the kind that will bring you 40,000 from cutting a girl but maybe 40,000 from cutting a garment and what they want to do now is to make uniforms and take these girls to school rather than marrying them off. Sentiments echoed by Kajadu County Commissioner David Kipkeme who also warned of stern action against perpetrators. Uyu mama alikuwa mkubwa wa kukata wasichana katika kaunti mzima na amekata wengi sana lakini tukisimama na yeye saizi hapa yeye ameokoka amewachana na hiyo maneno na sasa tunasunguka pamoja na yeye na wengine kuhakikisha ya kwamba msichana masai hako na uhuru wa kusoma mpaka mali atafika the women beneficiaries lauded the move saying it gives a new focus to women who have been aching out a living by endangering the lives of girls.